and connect. Repent and connect. God never counts our past against us if we would genuinely turn from them. If we won't turn, they will keep taunting us till the end of time. Prodigal son turned, and the father turned, as if he did nothing wrong. There was a huge celebration as he turned. Can you imagine somebody who wanted his father to die, and the father didn't die on time, he said, give me my hand, I can't wait anymore. I can't wait anymore. And then he returned, and there was a celebration. That's how God celebrates the return of any of his children, when they genuinely return. The things I used to do, I do them no more. The things I used to do, I do them no more. And the things I used to do, I do them no more. There's a great change since I saw the light. Great change since I saw the light. Great change since I saw the light. There's a great change. Since I saw the light, there's a great change since I saw the light. Please know, no one can be a true partaker of a move of the Spirit without genuine repentance. Turn you away from everything that displeases God that you know. And then he pours out the Spirit upon you and then it begins to open you up to revelations that will keep bringing changes and changes upon our lives. No one here will miss it. In the name of Jesus. No one here will miss it. In the name of Jesus. No one here will miss his portion. Upon this mountain you possess your possession. In Jesus' precious name. We have said that the midst of the year is ordained a revival season in God's agenda. I am the Lord, I change not. Revive thy work of God in the midst of the year. The prophet was declaring the mind of God. And so the amazing things that follow that are direct products of a revival. It will level out all everlasting mountains on your path clear off all perpetual hills. That's talking about breakthroughs in all areas of your life. And now he went forth for the salvation of his people. So every revival is validated by massive salvation of souls. Verse 13. Now while you are doing that, it may not appear as anything is happening, but keep rejoicing as you do it. Partner with me in my quest to see souls saved. It may not look like anything is happening. You may be a subject of mockery as a gateway to glory. <laughs> mockery is a pathway to glory. This path on his face, they press a crown of thorn on his head, but today he reigns forever and ever. Given a name above every name. Those who don't want the mockery they don't know that they don't want the glory. Every seed in the ground is fought stone to a mockery before it comes forth as glory. <coughs> you check your corn of maize. After three days as I planted it, it's messed up. The heat and the moisture breaks it up. It becomes smelly. Inside that smell will rise a life. And from that life will come multiplied returns of your seed soul. 
Even Christ. He didn't weigh much in the place where he came from. <coughs> they saw him as a runaway man. Nothing but a carpenter. Who didn't wait for freedom. <laughs> but now he reigns in majesty. Now he reigns in majesty. Yet I will rejoice in the Lord, not mind the democracy of men. The Lord will rise and make my feet like hands feet and get me up upon my high places. That height happens. What is a revival? A revival it can be defined as a move of the spirit across the people of all age groups culminating in supernatural turnaround testimonies all people upon my spirit upon all flesh young and old men and women boys and girls upon all flesh so in the upper room there were about 20 people there 11 disciples or apostles and the others. And the Holy Ghost fell upon every one of them in fulfillment of Joel 2, 28 to 29. All flesh. In the house of Cornelius, all his kinsmen and near friends, all the nephews, the nieces, young and old, were gathered together. Acts 10, 24. And then by Acts 10, 44, the Holy Ghost fell on all of them. Uh -huh. They were all baptized in water. A massive change of story. All flesh. All flesh. All flesh. And it's clear today, we just had a testimony of someone rescued from kidnappers. Hearing the voice of God directly in the dungeon of the wicked. All flesh. Young girl. Preparing to go to school in September. Teenager, adolescent. All flesh. So we're in the last days. We are all classes of people, age groups, gain access to the move of the Spirit of God. Again, our access is genuine repentance. Genuine repentance. Art 2. 